It's probably not a good idea to put all our eggs in the blockchain basket. While blockchain technology has some impressive features, it's not exactly a magic wand that can replace all institutions overnight. Plus, let's be honest, there are some things that we probably don't want to decentralize. Can you imagine trying to vote in a presidential election using blockchain? Talk about our day. So while blockchain may have a place in the future, we still need some good old-fashioned institutions to keep the world running smoothly, or as smoothly as possible. The Masonic Society of America, the oldest and the most secret society around town. Well, not really a secret, but they do have some pretty interesting rituals and tradition. It all started with the stone masons in the Middle Ages who got together to share tips and tricks on how to build some of the most impressive structures of the time. Nowadays, the Freemasons are all about personal development, charity and community service. They got lodges all around the world and they are always up to some symbolic and charitable activities. But shh, don't tell anyone. It's a secret society after all. Just kidding. It's not really a secret, but it does add a bit of mystery and intrigue to their already impressive history. And that is why. Stem cells are the superheroes of the medical world. They have the incredible power to transform into any type of cell which makes them like Clark Kent of the cellular universe. In regenerative medicine, stem cells are like the Avengers swooping in to save the day when other treatments fail. They can repair damaged tissues, fight off diseases and even reverse the aging process. It's like having a team of Iron Mans, Captain Americas and Hulks all rolled into one. And just like superheroes, stem cells also have secret identities. Embryonic stem cells are like Spider-Man starting out as innocent little embryos before developing into a powerful force for good. Adult stem cells, on the other hand, are like Batman quietly lurking in the shadows until they are needed to save the day. The Great Petrol vs White Petrol debate. It's like choosing between a cheeseburger and a veggie burger. Both have their own loyal fan base, but which one is truly superior? Petrol, or as some like to call it, liquid coal, is the OG of fuel. Made from crude oil, this magical portion is the lifeblood of cars and motorcycles. It's like giving your engine a dose of steroids, giving you the power to zoom past your grandma's house in no time. But what about white petrol? It's like the vegan alternative to gasoline. No lead, no problem. It's the cleaner, lighter and more eco-friendly choice. Plus, it doesn't give off that pungent gasoline smell. So you won't have to worry about people smelling you coming from a mile away. So which one is better? It's like trying to choose between pizza and tacos. You can't go wrong either way. Just make sure to fill up your tank before you hit the road. Or else, you might end up like a turtle stuck in molasses. So which side are you on? Subscribe.